from Nikki here, Smurfy161. Sorry I haven't been about for a while, um, but unfortunately I had one of my fits in the bathroom. I was giving Lexi a wash and unfortunately I had one of my drops and a fit and I whacked my hand against the bath and unfortunately Lexi bit my finger. Um, so I had to have some time in hospital and time with parents to sort of get over it all. Um, I'm not doing too bad now, I still have to be a bit careful with what I do um, with it. It's um, permanently <laughs> covered <laughs> at the moment, but it is healing well. So I've been a bit slow on my crafty stuff, so I'm finally catching up with some things I follow and take part in on YouTube, as well as just fun makes. So Cindy Utter, she does um, monthly challenge, and it's also got a Facebook group called Art Artsy Endeavours. If you look up Cindy Utter, you'll find her and find all the details. Um, so I want to do a divider for it first of all to go in my loose leaf folder because that's also going to be part of my year 2017 stuff. So I just made this cover um, divider for it um, and use one of my colouring pages because I'm trying to use up stuff that I've already made or coloured in. And then I've just done that so I know it's separate and a little tab. And January's challenge was to do a page with um, your colouring pages so I know a lot of us do love the colouring in pages but then you end up with all these images and what you do with it so um, yes yeah, so Cindy suggested came up with the idea of doing a layout with bits from your colouring pages so these are all different ones like this was part of a chocolate one this was from something else um, I can't remember. Um, yeah, so I've just done a little layout, kept it quite simple. But these little beads here, I don't know if you're going to see them, are uh, micro beads that came in my January craft box. I'm not going to do a video on it because it's now February and I've sort of not put away the stuff, but it's put to one side. But if I use anything from it, I will mention it in my videos. Yeah, so I just added that there for a bit of bling and then on the back wrote what month it was, what the challenge was and why I kept it simple and stuff like that. So that is pretty much that bit. So they're really good fun. Um, February's challenge is to make your own stamps and stuff, which I will do in a separate video. I then also did these little tags. They're part of my year prompts and I can't remember who came up with this little um, idea. The main theme for January was uh, confetti, bling, confetti bling and bubbles. Um, so yeah one of the people sort of running it came up with the idea of these little tags to make three. So I've added like um, embossing powder, a little cut out and some bling on that one. Flower and some Miri card left out of a stash so that's that one and then that one I thought I'd do three different sizes and then I'm going to put some twine through it and put it in this little pocket which is actually um, a pocket that my inhaler comes in so I thought I could put them in there and then each week um, Ian Jackson comes up with you do a poll so you choose which photo you want for the week and whatever wins is what you do so like this is week three week four so eventually I will get round to doing my version of them hopefully I will get to do them on video I'm not sure yet it just depends and I will stick that what I make with them and stuff all on one page so that's my plan for that and that's pretty much all I've got to say so I hope you're all okay and I will see you all soon bye